baseball. It's as American as apple pie. Or is it? With so many international players in the major league, cultural differences have become more and more evident among teammates. Fourth-year San Diego Padres pitcher Ernesto Frieri moved to the States from Colombia in 2005. He says the hardest transition was learning a new language. When I first got here, I didn't know anything about English. Uh, I, didn't, I didn't know how to say even hello, nothing like that. He says he felt awkward because he couldn't communicate with his teammates. Yeah, I'd take that step and start like learning, just watching TV, listening to the music and talking to my teammates. And that's that's how, how we learn. Frieri isn't the only one who struggled with language. I don't know English. <laughs> no, I don't know English. Edinson Volquez does know English, but that doesn't mean it came easily. It's hard the first two years, especially when you don't, you don't know what everybody's talking about. You know, it's kind of hard and different for people coming from Dominica. Major League Baseball is working to help these players with the cultural transition. Five years ago, the Padres started a rookie development program in the Dominican Republic. Our players that are down there go through this two-day event where they get lectures from everything from uh, assimilating to the culture, managing your money, dealing with the press, uh, an overview of as, as, as the importance of learning the language. Because these athletes aren't only learning a new language, they're adjusting to a new culture and even a new diet. I, I like American food too, but uh, the food from my country, uh, it's really, really good over there. <laughs> Frieri says it's been a learning experience, and his teammates are the best teachers. Reporting in Peoria, I'm Amber Harding.